What's up y'all, I'm Reed the Fishmonger, and today we're gonna taste test different fish tails. Ora king salmon, gray tile fish, yellow edge grouper, yellow tail snapper, snowy grouper, golden tile fish, cod, red snapper, and Atlantic salmon. Which do you think is gonna taste the best? Oh yeah, that looks awesome. Very excited to try out all these fish tails and review them for you guys. Let's try out one of the salmons first. I'm going for Atlantic salmon. Look how juicy that is, that looks awesome. Ooh, still hot. All right, let's review the tail first. Mm. I love fish tails. Two tough ones you get down to here. The top of it's awesome. Once you get further down, not so much. Not as mild tasting as a, a snapper tail, which I'm not surprised by that. Salmon tell me, it's good. Nothing special. All right, now let's try the Aura King salmon. I like how in the Aura King salmon tail, you can eat it almost all the way down where it's delicate enough. That's awesome. Let's try the meat. Aura King salmon tail. I gave it a six out of 10. Atlantic salmon tail. I give it a four out of 10. Let's try yellow edge grouper. So I want to say so delicate, it doesn't really have enough bite to it. I need some like, wouldn't need some batter. Deep fry, but some batter, have a little bit more bite to it. Um, yellow edge grouper is such mild meat, I'm a little surprised at how tail's a little gamier. Try the meat. Mm. The meat on the tail of yellow edge grouper, 10 out of 10. The tail itself, 5 out of 10. Let's try cod. I've never tried cod tail before. And well, it like bubbled. It does not look like it's gonna be delicate and yummy. That's weird. Yeah, I don't really wanna eat that. I'd say zero out of 10 on the the tail fin itself. Let's try the meat. Meat's much better. Uh, tail meat of the cod, seven out of 10. Gray tile fish, also called blue line tile fish. Mm. It's good stuff. I like that tail. All right, let's try the meat. Tail meat of the gray tile fish. You got nine out of 10. Delicious. The tail itself, seven out of 10. It's good, could have been better. Dry golden tile fish tail. Oh yeah. 
that's that perfect, not too thick, not too thin. That's awesome. Mm. But you can't eat it too far down. It gets too thick to eat pretty close up. Don't like that. So I was so good at the end, I wanted to eat more of it. Here's the tail meat of the golden towel fish. Wow. That was as good as any tail gets. Fluffy and juicy. The way everyone likes their tail. All right. Save snappers for last because everyone knows snapper tails are delicious. Let's look at yellowtail snapper and red snapper. Which do you think I'm going to like better? Which do you think you would like better? Oh, yeah. That's that perfect texture. Not too thin, not too thick. So far, you can eat it all the way down. That was a great fishtail. Peel away the skin. All right, now let's try the tail meat. Tail meat's delicious, mild tasting. Um, Yellow tail doesn't have as much fat to it. So I'm gonna say eight out of 10. If it was more moist, it would get a slightly higher rating. The tail itself, I'd say nine out of 10. It was a delicious fish tail. Red snapper tail. As expected. It's perfection. And then, as you get further down, it gets a little tough. Yeah, I wouldn't want to eat that. Yeah. A little softer in the middle. Alright, let's try the tail meat. Tail meat on that red snapper was good. You know, mild tasting meat. Didn't have the moisture content that the towel fish or the grouper had. So the, the tail itself, it's gonna get an eight out of 10. Get a higher rating if I could have eaten it further down. The tail meat. I'm going to give a, a 7 out of 10. Just disappointed it didn't have more moisture to it. It would have been very good if it was as juicy as the towel fish or grouper was. The loser is hands down cod. And thanks for watching, you guys. If you want more content like this, like, subscribe, and follow along for more. Thank you.